We have visited students at the University of Colorado who use robotic materials tactile sensors for the perception and manipulation stack of their Baxter robot. And we use an Asus XDM similar to like an Xbox Connect to get a 3D point cloud. And then uh, from that we process uh, the point cloud and we determine where our objects are. And this we can use to send our robot locations to go to, um, to go pick up the objects and do things with them. Uh, however, this doesn't give us a very good resolution, so uh, we can't determine when the, ob when the robot has made contact uh, and how hard the robot is grasping, and so um, we need finger sensors or some other type of mechanism to get this data. How to determine grasping events from sensor data is a potential task for machine learning. It's less resolution of data, so it's easier to actually learn from that data. Also, to do complex manipulation tests, you actually need these, this tactile feedback to actually uh, complete the test successfully um, that you can't do by just looking at an object by itself. The Colorado students are currently working on automating the task to the point that the robot can collect hundreds of hours of grasping data, information which can eventually be used to learn to grasp previously unknown objects autonomously and robustly.